All right, pizza review time. I'm here with a little bonus pizza review. I don't know when this one will drop. It might be months from now. It might be weeks from now. Who knows? Um, I actually went to the store a few days ago to buy Tony's Pizza, which the review for that has already dropped, so go back check that out. Um, went to a couple stores. Went to Target. Didn't have it. Um, then I went on to like a friend's house. On my way back, I was passing Mariano's. Decided I'll stop in there and try to pick up my Tony's. Didn't have that either. I didn't want to leave empty-handed. The whole reason I went into that store was to get a frozen pizza. So I saw Gino's East. That's a Chicago pizzeria. I think they're mostly known for their deep dish, but you know me. I'm a thin crust guy, so... I got their thin crust version. Pretty excited about this one. I think the um, ingredients are going to be really good. It has the perfect thin, crispy, crackery crust just like I love. I'm excited about this one. The bottom's pretty good. This one's pepperoni. I don't even think they make a supreme version of it. They make like pepperoni, sausage and pepperoni, and like a meat lovers. So let's give it a roll. Hmm. The crust is not quite as crisp as I was hoping it would be. The crust along the edge has got a good crisp, but on the bottom, it's average, average crisp. There's definitely something very unique in the flavor. Trying to pinpoint if it's the sauce or the cheese. I think it's the cheese. I like it. It's solid. It's nothing like super crazy good. It's not going to challenge the Newman's, which at the time of this review being recorded is not my highest rated pizza at a 8.1, I believe. I'm going to give it a, a 7.1. Good pizza.